Uh, greetings, family. This is Bomani Tamba and my brother Prince live on Revolutionary Camp. We're in Accra, Ghana, in the East Lagoon neighborhood, and uh, we are enjoying the journey of a lifetime. We have stayed back for an additional week to do research on Garvey Town, to do connections, to do business networking, and additional things. But my brother, we're going to get into a hardcore yeah. conversation that yeah. folks are scared to deal with. Yes, you yes, know? yes. You know, we're talking about race traders and black devils. Yes. You know? And then, you know, so uh, straight up, um, you know, we went to the African Holocaust dungeons. Yes. And then, you know, one of the things, uh, you know, we always talk about is the race traders that collaborated with the devils, you know. And anyway, uh, what we want to do is get your feedback of this situation based on you traveling around Ghana and seeing a few, you know, seeing different groups of white people, but also you're seeing the race traders slash black devils that accompany them and try to make them feel comfortable. Yes, yes, and you know, that, as I said, uh, it's, a, it's, it's, it's just one of those things that we as people have to understand ourselves. Because uh, if, you, if, you, if you are individual, knowing that you're gonna cut yourself and do harm, why cut yourself and you're gonna do harm to yourself? And uh, when you cut yourself and do arm, remember you, 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 you may, your loved one, you have to remember now you're hurting your loved ones and stuff like that. So we, we here in, in Ghana, we go to the, 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 the dungeon, we see all these people, not only that, you, these white people, they, they, they stare you down like you're not supposed to dare, even in debt. When we go, we, you, you know, even in debt, you, you have the separation of the burying ground, the two white people over here and the black uh, servant that served them faithfully it, yeah. is buried separate. Even in death, you're going to be separated. So we are asking our brother to, and our sisters, stop being a black devil. Stop letting down your people. Even this morning, even this morning, there's a group of people came came to this hotel and there was other men, other men in the group, and I saw this brother. He was going to he was going to the store with two carrying two cases of water. And I asked brother, where is the rest of men in this group to help you carry this water? So we are messed up. We have to stop. We have to stop being about placing ourselves in a bow down position. You understand me? We have to demand some respect. Have some respect for yourself. Stop, you know, uh, being a, a, a kiss ass. And I tell you, some of them will get up in your face too if, if you try to. You, you, listen, I'm, I'll tell you, it is, a, it is serious with these black devils because they do not have any self worth. They do not, uh, you can see it in their eyes. Some of them, you know, acting, they want even, they want even to use a bucket of bleaching cream to take off their blackness. Yes, yeah, serious. Yes. They, 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 they are dangerous to themselves and to their people. You understand me? Because they want to be white. They want to be white so much. If you, how can you, if you, if you take, if you take an African elephant and carry it all the way to Australia and that, that, that elephant give birth, that, this is still an African elephant baby. So why you want, you are in Africa, you are a black man, you cannot be a, a white person. You so it's crazy. So we are we are asking the black devils, the the one that the, the one that help betray our own people from time and immemorial. Stop it. Stop it. Have some respect. Have some self worth. You understand me? Look into yourself. Look at what is going on. We're not asking. We're not asking you for much. We're just asking you to have some respect. Have some self worth. Have some self confidence. Believe in yourself. So you want to tell me you you you, we, you know, you want to tell me that you think another man is more important than you? Did not did that man bleed like you? Did that man go to the bathroom like you? Did that man you know? Did that man having the, 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 the eyes like you and move like you? So why why you are bowing? Why you, you why you are betraying your brothers and your sisters? Don't make any sense, man. You are stabbing your own self in your in your gut. You understand me? And so. We are, we are asking, when you see your brothers and sisters on the ground, you know, trying to communicate with you, don't try to push your brother aside. Many times I saw black people with, you know, or, or African brothers and sisters with white, with Caucasian people, and you just try to holler at them to 
you know, ail them up and show them respect. Right. They they reject you. Yeah, they reject you. I was at the hotel and I saw this young lady and I, you know she was from the state and uh, you know I was just ailing up the sister. How are you doing? You know, but, but, but you know, how are you doing? That 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 sister walked past me. She walked past me with an attitude. You understand me? And I, and I said, my I went to, I went after her and said, my sister, why you why you why you why are you behaving like that? Why are you treating a brother like that? This is no, no, no. I'm, just, I'm, just, I'm, just, I'm just recognizing you as a sister. Why are you behaving like that? So we have some serious problem. You understand me? And I don't know what it is. You understand me? Anytime our folks go around Caucasian people, I don't know what they do to them. I don't know if it's a, 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 a disease, a, a disease of the mind, if it's something. I don't know. But they get real funny. They get real uptight and funny. So all, all of a sudden, they, they transform themselves to be... They even they even act whiter than the white person, you know. So, my brother, you have anything more to say about these uh, black devils? Yes, family. Uh, black devils and race traders. Uh, you know, uh, this um, combination of the same uh, throughout the history of our struggle as a people. This is one of the components that's been the most deadliest because they look like you and they try to act like you, but then they're about something else. So you gotta flush them out, you know what I mean? Like, you know, smoke yeah. them out of the fucking cave. Like mosquito, <laughs> like mosquito. <laughs> like bat. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, you know, so that's one of the serious issues. So we're building an energy, you know, so I'm just giving folks warning. Don't try to infiltrate, don't try to come around us, keep them away from us. Because once we catch you, you're gone. I had two people I ejected from the tour. Black, you know, they were black devils and race traders. Got rid of them. I told them to get the fuck out of here. Yeah. And you know, infection. That dead infection. serious. Try you know, to infect. You know, you don't want you know, an infection. You know, it's kind of like the <laughs> cancer. Once you find it, you gotta cut the cancer out. You know, you know, same thing to a, a rotten or bad apple. You don't want to spoil a bunch. So. Family, uh, you know, just you know, it's like uh, you know, you know, you, you're out here with us in the wilderness. You know, don't get don't get caught slip, slipping. Don't get caught, you know, to where you just get uh, stranded. So, just a general warning. You no know, threats. Uh, you know, we want the best people with us, connecting with us, doing business with us, nation building. You know, we are already behind, and uh, so, you know, uh, you know, so you know, we're gonna encourage race traders. Race traders to go and redeem yourself and seek some fucking psychological help. You know, because you are hating on yourself, your future, and your children. Mm -hmm. you know, just because you think these white and Asian devils are winning right now or whatever you think they are, it doesn't mean that's how it always and will be. You know, in, the, in the beginning, it was us. In the end, it will be us. That's simple. Yes. And we need to need you guys to stop. Stop it. Because you want, you want to kill your brother for a piece of paper. You want to kill your brother for a piece of paper. You don't know what is true, true wealth. You know, these, they, 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 these people, they build their system on uh, and back their money by these gold and diamond and precious mineral and the resources in the land, you know. That's what they back their money, they, they, they real, real resources by. So why you want to kill your brother for a piece of paper? Why you want, you know, it don't make any sense. Why you don't want to unite with your brothers and your sisters and share your information. You know, we'll go all different places and share our valuable information with, you know, with, with other folks. You understand me? We'll show them everything. I was talking to this young man and he were telling me we had a conversation. And this is what we need to, to really, 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 really address. We are not saying that people go, uh, we, I am against, uh, you know, dating out of the race. I am against it. You know why? Because sometimes those, you know, I've if to show us, those children are still in place and upholding the same behavior, bad behavior. You understand me? To oppress, uh, uh, you know, and using colorism and using classism. We need, you know, so we, we, are, we, are, we are telling our brothers and sisters that are betraying us in every aspect. Just think about it and see where we are going, you know, with this thing by using the uh, valuing paper over our own human being. Or, you know, and because all that paper and everything that was created was created by a human being. So there's, as I say time and again, 
material stuff cannot com compare or should never ever compare to a human being because the human being create all this stuff. You understand me? So get it right and don't get it twisted and don't get your, 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 your you know, some of you guys like to wear G-string. G get the G-string G out of your ass and, and, and <laughs> you know, stop fuck around with, with you know, with, with, with it. The, the true history and let us build together as one people, one love, one aim, one destiny. You make letter, you have to get it together. You understand me? And Red Straighters, I want you to put, we, we want you to acknowledge yourself from far. Go and get a big red sticker and stick it on your forehead that we can point to you, we can, we can see you clearly. And if it is, if it is dark, so in the, in the day, you will want you to wear that red stick on your forehead. And in the night, we want you to have some, some LED lights on your forehead. <laughs> you will see you from far. <laughs> you understand me? So we, we, don't, we, don't have to, we don't have to search you too much. And uh, you will be, you, you know, I guess when we, we do so much work to search you, search, search you out, we have to punish you with, we're gonna punish you with the truth, real hard. So in order not to be punished with the truth, real hard, put on those red stickers and those those LED lights. Yes, brother, yeah. <laughs> yes, brother, yes, you know, so family, uh, uh, be careful of these black devils and race traders because they are direct opposition to the revolution and the movement they have always been. And then when, you know, we keep it strong in our operation so you, we catch you, you know what I'm saying? It's like decent, you know, it's like, you know, we're gonna, we're gonna expose you. Yeah. You know what I mean, because, you know, so, that's all we got to keep on doing, family, so let's keep it strong.